So you're today you're you're known and respected as a as a very knowledgeable ACD car guy, Auburn's Cords, Duesenbergs, and the like. Would you say some of those times you had with your dad really gave you a broadened look on other cars and how to appreciate other makes, models, and why why they why they appeal to other people and why they should appeal to you? Maybe as I think back growing up in Auburn, Indiana, you know the classic car capital of the world. We have Auburn's Courts, Duesenbergs, and we have our ACD Club reunions. And, and the parades and auction and all those things. And so it would not be a big surprise that naturally I really enjoy and appreciate Auburn's Cords and Duesenbergs. And what I have learned over the years is, you know, why, why do I like those cars? Yes, I was around them. So those have been the first uh, big cars that I would have been exposed to, but as I start to think about it, you know, to me, as an example, the Duesenberg is a majestic automobile. It's a fantastic work of art. But to me, it's also the quintessential illustration of what the American dream is all about from a materialistic standpoint, which is being able to go out and get a Duesenberg. So, so to me, and I think a lot of guys in the collector car hobby, the acquisition of one of those cars is, in many ways, from an American car standpoint, a pinnacle of collecting. And as I think about that, and then I think about, you know, beyond Auburn, Indiana, and beyond the United States, and people around the world, they approach things from a similar standpoint. But also, a big thing is the usability. You know, as I have had the opportunity to hang out with a lot of ACD club guys, and work on cord engines or go for a spin in an Auburn Boattail Speedster, you begin to understand the usability and the feeling that you get when you're doing that. And there's not a whole lot of experiences that can match or outdo you know, driving down the road in an Auburn Boattail Speedster and getting the looks and the waves and uh, you can almost sense the excitement and enjoyment of other people because that car is just driving down the road. And in those cases, you know, I get to be in it. Uh, so that enjoyment level is just so much higher. So whether it's me from Auburn driving a, a Speedster or it's someone from a different part of the country, different part of the world driving a car, that experience is really the same. 